good morning to everybody. My name is Sergio Andres Preciado. I'm going to talk about some places that we, we visited here in our state in Canada. First is the Museum of Nature. What can I say about this museum? Is that in this museum uh, you can see all the nature that involves Canada, signs the prehistoric and the dinosaurs uh, until in our times, and you can see all the animals and typical animals and species that Canada has. These pictures we can see the prehistoric time, we can see some fossils of dinosaurs, also we can see in real life representation of all the dinosaurs like T-Rex and Triceratops. Uh, in this picture, we can see, as uh, we can see, some fossil of prehistoric animals. We can see animals that are right now, like the polar bears. And in this picture, we can see a polar bear trying to catch a, a seal. This picture is really my favorite picture because it seems so real. You can see it's a bull hawk, and you can see he's in his natural habitat. In this we have a mammoth, it is a prehistoric animal that 10,000 years ago he was still living in Yukon territories. And in this we can see the evolution of the hawk. The Notre Dame Cathedral. This cathedral is a exactly replica but smaller than the one that is in, in Paris. Uh, in, this, in this cathedral we can see so many different uh, uh, cultures and so many different sculptures that we have and it's really impressive. This is the inside of the cathedral. We can see that it's really beautiful, it's really it's really working and it has really, uh, many ornaments. The Rio Canal. In the Rio Canal we can see that have a system of doors that allows to the boats to enter uh, to the to the river to inside the Rio Canal. The Rio Canal is really important and really beautiful in the winter because it gets it gets frozen and you can skate on this and this area right and this street and it's really beautiful. In here in the last picture we can see that the boat was was getting up by the water. In this picture we can see that they, they are opening the doors because the level of the water gets up. This spider is a symbol of the capital of Ottawa and they say that if you don't go to the cathedral, to the, uh, to the parliament and to this spider, it's, it seems that you don't go to the capital of Ottawa. Uh, the same picture. Uh, Roland Baldwin and Jean de la Fontaine. This two, uh, these two characters are really important for Canada because in the past they, they were the ones that, that invented the democratic uh, regimen and political regiment in Canada. Elizabeth II, this is the queen, the actual queen of, of Canada, and we have a sculptural sheet. The House of Commons, the House of Commons, uh, we know that Canada is a republic and it has a, 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 par, a executive parliament and the system of government is really uh, like to, uh, from the Colombian one. And the, the House of Commons is, is adorned by a green color that seems that uh, the prairie and the fields and all the, the green nature that has Canada. <coughs> the Cine, the Cine, and the Cine we have two chairs. The big chair is from the government, from the parliamentary government, and the other are from the speakers. We can see that in, in this we, can, we have a red color. And we have a red color because in London it's the same. They have to know the Senate, they have a red color that represents their loyalty. Canada's Wonderland. This is a really special place because when we was in Toronto, uh, we spent a, late, a great funny time and we was really happy. This is the inside of Canada Wonderland. We can see that they have many phones and they have a, a waterfall. Toronto. Uh, this is a really beautiful city, it's a metropolis, and we can see that it's really like, like New York, but we, uh, it's, a, it's really interesting and really, really beautiful. The Cien Tower. In the Cien Tower we can see it's the highest tower in the world, and it's really amazing, and when you are uh, in, uh, inside the tower, you can see all the city of Toronto. The wonderful Niagara Falls. 
this is the, the Niagara Falls. We can see that is the American uh, Fall. The Horseshoe Fall. The Horseshoe Fall is the Canada's uh, waterfall and it's the most beautiful and longest. And, he, and we can see that this is the build of the Cascade and it's so amazing. It's the same picture and we can see the boat that is coming to the waterfall. This is the American Waterfalls. The main of the myth is about that uh, when you pay, uh, he, uh, he gave you to the inside, almost inside of the of the waterfall. And in the mist, you get all, all wet because the the the, the strong is so strong the the fall of the water that it is it spring a lot. Thank you.